Hi everyone. Today we have a Brone QTX 110 HL heater fan light unit. And what I'm going to show today is how to change the heating element out of this heater. Um, the heater element's located inside, so once the grill is taken down, this part you would see from the ceiling. And what you would do is, first thing, and the most important thing, is make sure the power is turned off. Um, you can turn it off at the circuit breaker. This is the, the safest thing to do. Um, the first step to removing this whole heating assembly is you're going to remove, and I'm going to go ahead and, and do that here. And that's one. And two. Next what I'm going to do is I'm going to unplug the heating assembly. And you can just give it a little tug. And then actually what I'm going to do then, because this is the motor, and it goes into the same plug as what's feeding the heater. So I'm going to unplug that heater. This heating assembly can pull out of here, just like so. Now I'm going to go ahead and just remove this housing here so we can take a look at it so the heating assembly once it's removed this is the heating coil you can see it on the on the inside of that unit there's two screws here that we're going to remove one two and this heating element will pull right out. You have to turn it kind of on an angle because it's got a little plate in. And that's it. I mean, that's all that's involved in taking this coil out. Um, you can take this one, throw it in the, in the garbage, and you can replace it with a new one. And basically, you just do the reverse steps. You slide it in. Put it in place. And you put your screws back in I'll go ahead and and do that so it's just two screws and that's all it is and you can put it right back into the housing and and plug the heater back in and then Plug it back into the main receptacle once it's in the housing. And that's it. I hope this video helps.